Hey guys, it's Fancy, and you're watching the Good Wives Network, and today has been quite an adventurous day. I'm about to head to bed. Um, we've heard something about police and Rod moving out, and we've had our own dealings again with some old friends, and we have been hearing from Ken Urker and Katie Joy and Natasha and Ryan and I. We're all kind of going for truth, and they're not, so it's going to be an interesting ride. However, for those of you, Belle, and the rest that say that you made that lovely dramatica page where you think you detailed my entire life and all my lies thanks for all your hard work because you put together my whole life now you've got some details wrong i'd like to clear up one thing for a lot of you some of you have accused me of stolen valor that i never served in the military now i will never ever give you my dd214 because you know what it's none of your fucking business. It's a government document, and you do not get to have my government document. So, fuck you. But, let me help you out real quick with something I can show you. It's got timestamps and postmarks and everything for you to understand so easily. Let me go grab it for you. So today I told you I was cleaning out my closet and I was looking for some different information. And it's so funny when you're actually looking for something and you find the other things that you didn't even know you were looking for. So this, if you can see here, do you see where that comes from? Are you seeing that that says A.B. Matson, April L. Yeah, that's my maiden name and it's coming from Lackland Air Force Base. That's a letter to my mom and my grandparents. Let me get it for you. We get this, this is a really interesting letter and it's gonna prove to you exactly where it came from, okay? Okay. What you are looking at here is my actual form that I sent, and my mom's name is cut off over there, mom and nana and papa. You notice it's dated the 19th, uh, December 3rd of 1994. And it tells my parents and my family when it is that I am supposed to be graduating and when it is that I will be walking and they can come and make arrangements to be able to see that, that parade um, pass and review. And I got recycled because I had a problem with a dorm chief. Go figure. Um, but so there you go, guys. This is the proof you won't get, you're going to get. And if you say that I have stolen valor again, I'm going to start looking at you a lot harder. You know who I'm talking to. Have a good one from the Good Wives. Serving up true crime, one dish at a time. It's not nice to hurt service members because you're sick and twisted. It's not okay what you're doing. You need to stop. Oh, and real quick, you wanted to know what branch I was in because I think you put Marines at one point and then somebody else said, Army, I don't know, I don't pay attention to your nonsense as closely as I probably should. Um, but hey, no, I wouldn't have gone in the, air, in the Army with the grunts and I certainly was not going to do Marines or Navy. I went the smart girl route and I scored in the top 10% of the, anybody in the country who took the ASVAB. So I went to the Air Force because that's where the smart people go. Now I'm not knocking the other air, the other service members. They are fantastic, but everybody knows if you have a brain, you're in the Air Force because they foster that shit and they need that shit. And it's not serving a purpose in, of, in the other different types of infantry when they are in a war situation. So the Air Force, all the way, baby. And we got the best bases. But, well, I don't know. Navy bases are pretty good. Anyway, have a good one from the Good Wives. Serving up to Craig, one dish at a time. Bye. Be safe out there.